All right. All right. Oh, wait. Yeah, I should actually put Chandler, I'm going to have to check that. I'm going to have to check it. On Instagram. Yeah, go. you guys are going Slide on Ashley's Instagram. Say hi. Hey. Say hi. Hey. Get in the chat. Ashley and I will be in Hawaii for vacation at some point, I'm sure. We, the Asian wants us there. She I didn't know you were in Hawaii. You know I was there, right? Oh, went through games. Thank you. Thank you for the 50 and okay. Wait, I know where you're from, Winther. What is that? And okay. I don't know. But he says, been here since 2014. What about an El Camino type movie after the Sega series? Like, that's the sequel. I like that thought, actually, a lot. Taz has been watching you since Sega series. Sick. Thank you for the $5. Snow note. Can you tell us a story of you two meeting? Like, your first date, not just text on Tinder. You got it. Stephanie, thank you for $2. Jesse, is that a wedding ring on her finger? No. That's just a ring she has. That could not be right. Swift got Bridget pregnant? What? It said five minutes, but like... No, that's doing, that you put on six hours, so it's been ten minutes. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. They smell great, though. Thank yeah, you, Porter Boy. All right, I'll tell you the first story of me and Ashley. If I missed some donations, Aww. I'm sorry. I'm going into story time. Uh, but my favorite thing about Ashley is just how chill and easygoing she is. Aww. Like, for real. She's so, she's so just go with the flow. Like, honestly, when you really think about it, I, I've only been dating her for a few months now. I'm probably going to do, like, a dedicated tweet or post about this because I've really been thinking about it a lot. It's just crazy how, like, she's been in videos, she's been on live streams, she's been, like, changing, like, her whole look on social media and, like, modeling for merch and just, like, watching all my videos, which is a lot. Like, I, <laughs> I, I, I've never had something, somebody so, like, dedicated or at least supportive. So, like, it's still weird for me to process a little bit. But how we first met, Luke says, preferring Christmas. First bid, love over cheers. Love over cheers, man. That's that's OG right there. Um, we were talking on Tinder, and I was like, yo, you should come over. She came over. This is the short story of it. She came over, and we, you know, we were awkwardly small talking. Then we were like real talking, learning about each other. And then I was like, yo, you want to Netflix and chill? <laughs> I wasn't trying to get any. I mean, maybe. Maybe no. a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Um... But then, uh, yeah, we, we watched this really crappy horror movie called Gehenna. It's on Netflix. I did not have the balls to kiss her. So for those of you guys who feel like you can't ask a girl out or you have struggle kissing the girl on the first date or just at, in, at all, that's I'm right there. I was struggling. I wanted to kiss her, but I was like, I don't know if she's into me like that. But obviously she's into me. She'd come over to the house and is watching Netflix on the couch with you, you loser. So uh, we, got, we got done watching the movie. She didn't want to sleep over. I was like, I didn't ask that yet. I was just walking her to her car. I was like, okay. And then I was like, God damn it. Fuck it. Fuck it, YOLO. And I just turned around and kissed her and grabbed her. And then uh, we kissed some more. And then I was like, yo, are you trying to come in? She's like, nah. And I was like, all right. <laughs> oh, my God. That's the first day. Is, are, is, don't you miss that? I feel like that was so long ago, but yet it wasn't. I know, it was only a few months. Or no, no, actually no. It was, it was more like for uh, five months. That was like yeah, five months ago. Yeah, but I feel like it was like a lifetime ago. Shannon says, thanks for two bucks. Thank you guys for the money. Uh, I love you, It's helped a lot. I'm heading to South Jersey in two days. Why are you coming here? Yeah, what's, what's in South Jersey for you? Luke loves, is me? Uh, Luke loves the $2. <laughs> also love Gary Come Home video, Club Ridgeway. Hell yeah, Club Ridgeway tonight on a Friday night. Um, yeah, I was just singing that on Twitch two yes, nights ago. two nights ago we were singing. Yeah, I love, that's so my, you, you were like into it. Yeah, that's my favorite Spongebob song, like better than the it's Bubble it. Bowl. Yeah. I love the Bubble Bowl. Ophiriel says, kind of shitty you made Ella's real death part of a series, and this is from a fan since the beginning of Sega series. Uh, no, there was no series out of Ella's death. No? That was just real. Um, I mean, obviously it's, it's a part of me and my narratives, because it's my real life, and it's something that like, I feel, uh, that's like where my heart is, so like my... Your heart always kind of comes out in your creative work. That's the whole point. It's kind of like a therapeutic release in a healthy way. Uh, Call me whenever says five dollars. Thank you, man. Uh, how do you deal with a creative block? You inspire me to become a filmmaker, but lately I'm going through a massive creative block and it sucks. So we had this uh, question on Twitch.tv slash Magician, which I encourage you guys. If all two thousand of you go follow me on Twitch.tv slash Nuggets. That would be incredible because you guys have missed out on so many heartfelt conversations, getting to know the real me, actually have some fun times. Please go check that out because we'll be streaming on there more than we do this. We, I don't know how many times we'll do a YouTube live. But 
to deal with creative block, um, there's two things you can do. And this, this is the answers I usually give. One, either you need to hit eject and go walk around in nature, relax, go consume things, go out to eat, go on a trip, travel, uh, just talk to people, talk it out, talk your ideas out, bounce them off right, other look people. At this wow. Oh, um, this really or, oh. or what you could do is the other way is you literally just need to force yourself through it. So for me, I really did not feel like writing a million different times. Um, but however, I had a deadline that I had to hit. I knew I had to get a video out every week for like MBE or Sega series was two a day or just as a grind, 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 grind. So like I would recommend either you force yourself and stop bitching and just be like, yo, I have to get something out by this date, similar to like a homework deadline. Um, or say, okay, take it easy. Let me relax. Let me go take a walk and, and just eliminate as much distraction as possible. Cause social media, all this bullshit will inhibit you from being in a creative mindset. Got to go for the night. Love you, Jesse. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you, guys. Thank you, all this yeah. Love from Wales. Love you, guys. Oh, Shannon's visiting 10 days for family. That's awesome. Winter says, remember when you told me to work with what I'm passionate about over Skype? I'm taking a year off to do videos right now. I love it, bro. Nice. I love that. I know that was not easy, but at the same time, oh. it was easy to make that decision. I just oh, destroyed I wanna, this cookie. I want to just eat. They are so hot, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Oh, wait. The one I destroyed. How's it taste? Too dry? There's no butter? It's not bad. Towards the end, it gets better. Yeah. Not too bad. Dude, if I had a few of these in milk, I'm golden. Too bad. I'm definitely doing that tonight. I'm getting like yeah. four cookies. Big fall glass of milk. <clears throat> That's all I want. Winter, super proud of you, bro. Always do what you love. If you don't enjoy it, don't do it. Find something else. If you need money, trust me, you can find money anywhere you look. If you're doing something you love, you'll find the money. Believe it. I know it sounds crazy. You will find it. Because you're, you're going to work as hard as humanly possible if it's something you're passionate about. And when you're working at your your hardest, you will find a way to make money off it. Call me whenever. Thank you for the $10. Thank you, man. A big dream of mine is to work with you and create a series for Hell yeah. I love that. Let's do it, man. Let's make it happen. I ain't going anywhere. We got plenty of time. Ty Film, thank you for the $2. Lazarus, thank you for the $20, my bro. I love your videos. Oh, my God. Subscribe and like. Thank you. Beverly, would you ever want to make a series for Netflix? Definitely. Netflix, I absolutely love the company. I think Netflix is brilliant. I feel like they're a very good company. I love the team. I love I love everything about Netflix. I would love to work with Netflix somehow. That's More that was cookies. That's probably gonna be part of my goal uh, in the coming years, honestly. Love Netflix. Yes. Learned it. And it seems like dude, they're just they're hooking a lot of people up with con with the money, with financing. The ability to make a movie show. Who is the better cook? He is. <laughs> huh? I haven't cooked anything. Really? Did I cook anything? I'm more baker. He's more cook. That's a perfect team. Yes. Been a fan since Sega Dead Drowns Xbox. That's awesome. Just want to shout out my brother. We lost him June 3rd in a head-on collision. He's 29. Taz, really sorry, sorry to hear that, man. That's honestly a scary thing. So, yes. Uh, Bridget, we are making oatmeal raisin cookies. Yes. Look at that. That is that looks delicious. Look at that, babe. <laughs> oh, so flaky, delicious. It looks exactly like the picture. Yeah, actually, we did good, babe. Um, we'll save some for you and Mike, Bridget. Oh, because she's got the pregnancy craving, so she's Ooh. probably like, oh. She's probably like, oh, I want like. Tell Mike, shit. be like, Mike, get your little driver's license and go get me some oatmeal raisin cookies. <laughs> Sparkle Tron, think of the two bucks, man. Call this a donation. That is a donation. Thank you, man. Uh, Lit G, yes, you can have a sample. We're trying to make enough for everybody, so we're going to be at this for a couple hours now. I want to eat another one, but I want to I want to pace myself. You gotta eat them while they're hot, though. That's the best. I don't, I don't, I don't, yes, I don't. eat them while they're hot. You don't want to wait till they cool down. Better when they're hot. Yeah. Yes. That's anything. You when they just came out of the oven, though? Oh, I'm gonna yes. burn my tongue. Yes. 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 Ashley said no. Oh God. <laughs> Kill me, guys. Kill me. Isaiah says I'm an old juggy. 
Uh, there's actually no Karen. Have you, you guys haven't met yet, have you? No. no. Uh, Lonely Pancake, love your videos, man. Watched since 2015. You kept me going through the toughest parts of my life. Uh, oh, thanks, man. Glad I could do something for you. My worthless ass. Fear Toxic, Aww. thank you for that. <laughs> Fear Toxic, thank you for the $2. There's a shout out, brother. Love the videos. Thank you. Riley says, love your stuff. Some of the most creative and awesome videos out there, man. I love when I can't tell what's real or not. I watch it for the end of the second Thank you, Riley. Appreciate the donation, man. You guys are fucking incredible. I know. Jesus. I'm eating a cookie. <laughs> oh, this is actually the perfect temperature. Babe. Is it good? Is it bad? Literally a hair right there. That's a fuzz. What the fuck's the difference? I don't know. <laughs> uh, oh. How do you know that it come from you? Look, it's right there. Ew. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, it's really good, though. Hey, it's still there. That's all right. I'm eating it. This is really good, though. <laughs> that looks like a stamp hair. Stamp hair? <laughs> when will you do Smash? I just never played Smash Brothers. <laughs> I have not. <laughs> Uh -huh. Lazarus, thank you for the donation. Yes, Boogie is a very big juggie, and uh, yeah, my dad, my dad fucking random games over the lawnmower, guys. <laughs> um, HC hey, bro, yeah, I'm pretty sure like the Sidemen um, and like Joe Weller and a lot of those guys over in in Europe got popular off of um, FIFA videos, soccer videos. So there's definitely an audience for soccer or El football on uh, YouTube. More in the oven. Mm. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Push that side of it. Yep. Okay. Wow, pretty yeah, good, dude. Those are good. I love them. Good. Wow, they're delicious. Mess, and they won't mess with your belly. Um, Shannon says, Where is Jeffrey? You want to get Jeffrey on the screen for a sec? Let me get him to try one of these goodies. Let's get Jeffrey to taste it. Mighty Loves, you thank you for your heart. Did you really have a thing for Karen? No, that was always a thing for the series, kind of just for the videos. We wanted it just to get, oh. you know, get people like, ooh, like I shipped them, kind of deal. Mm. Uh huh. Jeffrey. <laughs> Jeffrey, you gotta eat our cookies. Jeffrey. Jeffrey. I am trying so hard to read this, but it's going so fast. Jeffrey's coming, guys. Who's coming? 